the National Science Foundation, America's investment in the future, and by the Corporation for Public Broadcasting, a private corporation funded by the American people, the Weezy Foundation, and by contributions to your PBS station from viewers like you. of kids write to send us ideas. We also get letters asking us how we got on Zoom. Here's one. Dear Zoom, hi, my name is Jenway K. I'm from Lansing, Michigan. I want to be on Zoom when I am older. My big sister told me that you have to go to auditions to be on Zoom. What kinds of things do you do during auditions? Did you have to come back and audition more than once? Did you have to audition with other kids or alone? How many kids auditioned? Can you? I'll be watching. Cool. So, you want to know how we ended up on Zoom? Well, this is us before Zoom. All of us are regular kids going to school. What's today? Thursday at school. Sports. Oh, I got it. Music lessons. <laughs> watching Zoom on TV, just like you. And then, Zoom auditions. <laughs> It said, if you want yeah. to pay up for Zoom, yeah, yeah, call, the, yeah. call the WGBH number. For information, call the Zoom audition hotline. We set, we set up a call, and they gave us a time, what day to come in, Saturday or Sunday. And, yep, I remember that day. It was snowing so bad. And we were the only people on the road. My mom's like, we're going home. <laughs> and I'm like, no, no. My name is Noreen. And do you want to hear a joke? I tried it three times. I wrote a poem about the United States flag. F of his flubber, flubber loving, cover lover, flubber, probably. Miss Susie had a baby. She named him Tiny Tim. She put him in the bathtub. Oh, my God. And then the last time, I made it. You're here. Who's number one? Who's number two? Number three? The first auditions, it's kind of overwhelming. Yeah, yeah, it is. If there's numbers up to like 2,097. Yeah. I'm number 2,056. Yeah. Amazing. You're really shy, and you're like shaking, you're like, okay, yeah, and then the second one, yeah. you're not, you're more comfortable because you've seen yeah, the people yeah, who auditioned yeah, yeah. you already. Zoom, fun, educational, all in one. Zoom cafe, yummy treats, fun to make, fun to eat. The first year I tried out, I did that rap. I was walking around in school one day, and I noticed a boy that looked sort of great. What I thought was the hardest part was that you only have like a minute to do it. No, you got it bad when you're out with someone, but you keep on thinking about somebody you had it bad. Yeah. I was so nervous when they told me to sing because I didn't even know what I should sing, so I'm like, ugh, so I got up there. I'm still not sure what I'm going to sing, and I'm like, ugh, I don't know any words for any songs. Ugh. La cucaracha, ya no puede caminar, porque le falta, porque le falta, un pie para caminar. I remember in 
one of the auditions, we had to like uh, make a product, like our own product. Tired of those marbles? Oh, stinky marbles! Now I have a bigger ball that bounces. I did purple hair gel. This is our new stay hair gel. Buy it, and if you buy now, then you will you will get a free hair brushing. Hair brush. I just happened to have my pocketbook with me, and I had a comb in it. And so I made like the Kimmy Kimmy Conga comb or something like that. And it was a comb that grows. It was a comb that grows your hair longer. Simmy Simmy Slumber, the magical comb that grows your hair longer. I once had short hair, but when I use the Simmy Simmy Slumber, the comb that grows your hair longer, look at me now. I did veggies. Hey kids, have you had trouble eating your veggies? Well, try Veggie O's, the sugary but nutritious vegetable cereal. Hey. When I made it back on that, and I just finished my last, my last audition, I was like, whatever. I don't, I didn't know if I did bad or good. Oh, yeah. I'm school on Monday. I'm walking home. I turn around the corner, and I see these balloons hanging up across the tree in Zoom colors. I walk home with my friend. I'm like, dude, I gotta go. <laughs> So happy. <laughs> and the same thing happened to me. I got off the bus with the balloons thing, but I got home. We called the producer, and the producer says, we'd like to invite you to be on this season cast. This year. And I was like, oh, my God. I was so happy. In the beginning, we didn't even know each other. Well, <laughs> except for Carl Shingen and Francesco, who were together last year. Welcome to the Rhyme Time Diner, where things can be any finer. <laughs> What's wrong with this lady? But the rest of us were new, mm -hmm. and we had to start building our team. So our producers send us off to Camp Zoom. <laughs> well, it's sort of a camp, but it's not a real camp. We went to learn how to be a team. But that was the second day we've seen each other. I know, and we didn't even like know each other practically. I just sleep in a tent with girls I had no clue who. Yeah. Hey. You guys, this is Brian. Everybody, Brian. Hey, Brian. Hey, Brian. Hey, Brian. Hey, Brian. Yeah, and Mara and Brian were really good coaches. How many tents do we need? Two. Two. You're going to have one boy tent and one girl tent? Yeah. Yep. That was probably one of the first teamwork things we did together, like where we all had to work together. I know, like, I, I didn't even know Nick at that time, because yeah. I remember that was like the second time I met him or something. Right. So. Setting up the tent, like the first thing we actually did on the campus trip was the first thing we actually like got together yeah. and had to do. Yeah. yeah. That was part of building our team, because yeah. when you're working on a Zoom side, Zoom challenge, you don't go out, exactly. and you have to learn how to do it yourself. You pick this spot because it's not very lumpy, and there aren't any thorns in the bushes nearby. We picked this spot because we thought it was suitable for us. We're like down, away from everyone, secluded by ourselves. So it's pretty cool. Okay, just so you know, this is a drainage pit. It's all rocks. Everyone stepping a rock. Oh, and then where we chose to put our tent, it was like this little ditch thing that we were like, ooh, that's a cool ditch. And then we realized there were so many rocks there. So when we went to lay down, we were like, oh, this is sweet. <laughs> we're trying to kind of build the tent up with the purple uh, stick. If we have the basic image, we can um, try to make the tent. Well, we're attempting to actually put this tent up. And we really needed the help. We're yes, nice. Oh, we made up pretty well after a little help from Brian. But I uh, we got it ourselves. We got it done pretty fast. Though. I know. Like, we didn't have time to help the girls and stuff. I know, because we were like done, and then like the girls were like, how do you put this together? <laughs> oh, our tent was like bigger and better than the boys' tent. But we got the good tent. We got the good tent. They got a, a teepee. Let's get our oh. stuff in here. Yeah, we'll be better when we get our stuff in here. Yeah. Yeah. I think we all fit together pretty fast.